or your funeral. I will either castigate you or praise you. So that one I will take the challenge. Why I have why why I have picked on Moses Ali is this. Moses Ali is grandfather, the father of his father, is buried in Palabek. His own father grew up in Palabek before relocating to Ajumani. Moses Ali has got half brothers and sisters here, here in Ajoli. His mother's co-wife remained and when, 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 when his father died and remained in Ajoli. He has names. Maybe he should be able to tell you who they are. Moses Ali joined the army in 1968. On the quarter, honorable means for defense. This, this, friend, this brother of mine, he joined on the quarter of Ajuni district, not my district, in 1968. He was a school teacher, having started in Coach Goma Church of Uganda. He joined the army when he was in Anaka Girls Catholic School, 1968, under Ajuni district quarter, not my district. I told him what elders here, the people like Bishop is already we know. I, I wish I wish the, the late Anania Taylor was alive. When you look at the coat of arms from Mali district, the identifying feature is a cochrane, a cock. That cochrane was given to Mali by the jury. The jury identifying Identity was the identified instrument was a cock. Then he asked you to the children say, No, we are too big for a cock. <laughs> then we beat the elephant and we gave you a cock. <laughs> so we are happy with that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we stayed in, in peace. I have, you know, for me, I do a lot of research, I do a lot of consultation with elders. Ajuni district local government, Ajuni district local government in the 1950s sent three sons of Ajuni district to Bulaya, UK, to study on how to manage local governments. Seme uh, Nyansi, there is this one, I remember the name Okidi. He was, he was secretary, company secretary in the 90s, a long time. He, he is one of his names, I don't know what I'm getting. And then, there was Moses Ali. A Nubian called Bakit, who had become an attorney. This is, this is how we in Africa are. That Nubian was called Bakit. He went and studied on the scholarship of a jury district. Later on, he became a minister in the minister. <coughs> But you don't use the name of it, I don't know what you might know. If you do, you tell us. We were at peace with all our neighbors. To a point where, even if you are going to, to Yumbe, Koboko, you're going to Karmoja, you still have to come to Guru as the headquarters of Northern Uganda. The hub of Northern Uganda. Zero, 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 Tamawai. This is kind of yours, actually in. That was the nerve center for Northern Uganda. Everybody who mattered, this way they would converge, talk development, build relationship, and so on and so forth. The story of told about how how the cop beat him. How he ridiculed the Minister of Defense, Sandy Sunama. He told Unama drinking in the bar of your hotel. Really want people. But things happen. Things really happen and the biggest problem is in my turn, okay, they say meaning you know you have a tongue in your foot here. But you think because you're putting a pair of shoes, it will not help you. When there's a wound festering and the day the pass gets out. It's like champagne when you shake the bottle like this and you open it, you know what champagne does. And we realize these things are happening. 
when issues like Apa come up, then you realize we are still so far apart. And yet, the our country we, we are the richest society in the world, we Africans, in making peace. Bending spears, Matoku, doing this and that. You know, because brothers, we don't always quarrel. Once somebody is your neighbor, the good, the bad, and the ugly will happen. You fight to reduce the ugly and the bad, so you can the good, you can work the good. So I tell you, the good Prime Minister here said, for how long are we going to continue like this? Why do you go to the president to solve the apartheid issue?